This is the best system I've found to keep my gear safe and allow me to run around as fast as I need to and get the job done. Hey, I'm a professional photographer and Cotton Camera Systems has sent me their CCS G3 two camera system for review. And although I didn't pay for it, my review is my honest assessment of its quality and practicality. But before I show you just how risky my job can be for life and limb and by extension my camera gear, like two weeks ago when my head and everything attached to it bounced off the ice, let's have a look at the G3 build quality and why this $169 Canadian piece of kit just might be for you. The stitching looks really good and the Codra synthetic canvas looks pretty tough. The buckles and the tethers are a high impact polymer plastic and the D-rings are made of metal according to my rear earth magnet. The polypropylene nylon webbing that looks similar to seat belt material has six adjustment points to make it as comfortable as possible for a one size fits all. The main cradles are made of nylon six which is a tough polymer with a high tensile strength. For example, synthetic nylon six fibers are used in aircraft tires and parachutes and glider tow lines. I need two hands free to get images up to the media people so they can get them out to the socials in real time while avoiding players being checked into my office and leaning over the boards and get no respect from the refs. I find that the cotton carrier enables me to do my job faster and better than any other systems that I've used before. Often I find myself having to move quickly up and down, back and forth, avoiding sticks and ducking pucks. I'm able to switch the cameras very rapidly, getting close shots of the bench with the 2470 and then back down the ice with the 7200. Okay, later I'm going to tell you a thing that I didn't like at first but I've since changed my mind. First off, I'm not gonna show you how to get the, into this thing or out of it, because if you can't get into it, then you can't operate a camera. So you won't be needing it anyway. Okay, so you saw in the intro, my hockey office is not large. It's four feet by five feet. Small just for me. What if there's another shooter in there where there sometimes is? You've got two, you got three, you got four cameras in there. It's not practical. To have cameras hanging from your sides and you're swinging and you're moving and they're banging and a bang and a bong and all over the place. You're either not going to get the shot you want or you're going to be stepping in some awful expensive glass. So I hope you're wearing your good shoes. That's why I like this vest. Keeps everything tight and secure to my body. And I know where it is at all times. Okay, on to the features. Oh, what falls? Whoa, it falls. Whoa. Oh, $10,000. I really like the side holster for when I'm only using one camera. It slides onto my belt so the weight is carried on my hip. You can either undo the Velcro and slip it over top of your belt or there's a slot sewn into it which helps immobilize it even further. The side holster is much smaller than the knockoff ones which I really like and it's got a pad on the back which really makes it comfortable. The lens strap completely secures the camera to your chest. The compartment behind it is where I keep the button wrench or you can put some cards in there too. And on the inside, there's another compartment. You could put cards or something in, but uh, it might get sweaty in there, so I don't know. I don't put anything in there. Included with the package is a rain cover, which is a nice touch. That'll go over the top of your camera. Only for the one, though. Okay, finally we come to the back compartment. There's a webbing on the back, and you can put a, a large water bottle in there. Possibly even uh, cold packs, which would be a good idea for really hot conditions. So-called quick tightening straps in the back. Yeah, I'd rather see them at the front. Doesn't work for me. That's one con out of, oh, one con that I found out of this thing. That's it. That's it. I'm sorry, my shoulders don't go back that far. Maybe you younger kids, but I not, you know what? There's an out. I don't like these things hanging down here. I'm not a fan, not a fan. I've got mine gathered up. One elastic, one of those elastic bands to gather it. I put, put one on myself. I don't like stuff hanging off me. That's just my, that's just me. I don't know, are you like that? It's my go-to system. This has been a busy few weeks, let me tell you. This review has been delayed, unfortunately, by a mishap I had with a concussion. Um, it took a little while to recover from that, but I'm all good now. In the past few weeks, I've covered a couple of curling championships, uh, trampoline championships, gymnastics championships, as well as uh, hockey playoffs. So I've really been putting this vest system through its paces, and I think I've got a good idea of what it's capable of. I'm just wrapping up from an assignment for a local newspaper, and uh, 
who do I recommend this product to? I recommend it to any photographer, really. Um, not just those who are in a highly active environment, not just those who are carrying two cameras, not just those who have to move about rapidly and have hands-free operation and not have to worry about the security of their gear. Um, I recommend it to any photographer. It's comfortable. And um, I think any photographer could make good use of it. The Cotton Company also sent me their quick release adapter plate, which is fantastic. You take the hub, you put it onto the adapter plate, which is Arca Swiss compatible. It's got several features, as you can see here. It's quick, it's easy, and it's toolless. Unlike my last system, where I had to get the tool out and swap them out individually. Now that's a time savings I appreciate. Okay, now here's what I changed my mind about. These quick release buckles. When I first saw them, I thought, mm, I don't think I like this idea but I've come to love them. These on my old system would get hung up on the, on the D-ring here and I would miss shots. Sometimes you get an idea, you want to get the camera really low or really high and you got to get it off the tether to do it. With these quick release buckles, it's one handed, boom, they're done. You get the camera where you need it to be and then you get it back on your vest and you do it back up. Great idea, can't live without them now. And thank you for watching. And if you want to purchase anything that's been used in the making of this video, there are affiliate links below. Uh, if you follow those, they won't cost you any more money, but it helps me to bring more products to review for you.